Hi friends, here is the second problem of arithmetic progression. Uh, let me read the question. Write the four terms of an AP. AP stands for arithmetic progression. When the first term A and the common difference D, right? First term A and the common difference D are given as follows. If we are given the com uh, common difference and the first term, then we can easily write uh, easily write the any term, whatever we need, right? Uh, but here uh, we are just asked to write the four, uh, uh, first four terms, right? So first term already it is given a it is 10, right? And the common difference is 10. So first term a1 is equals to of course a that is 10 and a2 is equals to a plus d this is common difference and I have already learned sorry I have we have already learned this uh, in common uh, in, uh, about common difference and this first term right in arithmetic progression introduction uh, video of the uh, arithmetic progression that in an arithmetic progression uh, if you just add a common difference then you will get the forward uh, number or you can say uh, if you just add the common difference in the preceding term you can get any term right you want suppose you want the fourth of uh, fifth term then just add common difference to the fourth term right if you want if you want the fifth term then just add common difference to the fourth term you'll be getting the fifth term right and suppose you want uh, the hundredth term then just add in 99th term just the common difference right just add the common difference in 99th term you'll be getting the hundredth term so would you want the thousandth term right thousandth term then just add in the 999th term just add the common difference or of that uh, arithmetic progression you'll get the thousandth term right so it is simple so i'm i want uh, i need here the second term that is why i'm just adding the common difference in the first term right so first term is a that is uh, 10 in situation here 10 and the common difference is again here 10 so 10 plus 10 that is 20 right so now the third term since I need the third term I'll be adding common difference to the second term and here second term is 20 right so that again am I adding the common difference that is 10 so 20 plus 10 that is 30 right now I'm writing fourth term that is third term plus the common difference right the third term is 30 we recently find out over here and the common difference that is 10 so 30 plus 10 that is yeah 40 so we need the fourth term we got the fourth term right so our series now is what is our series uh, or the arithmetic progression a1 that is 10 20 th sorry, 30 and the 40 and so on this is our required arithmetic progression right now let me do another one okay uh, let me do the second one we finished the first one uh, I'm doing now the second one with the different color okay we finished this now we're doing this too right so mm, let me write here let me do this here okay come uh, the first term is here negative 2 and the common difference here is 0 right so what we'll get right uh, so here a1 a1 will be of course the a that is 2 and a2 will be always what the first term plus the common difference first term here is negative 2 and the common difference here is the 0 so it is just negative 2 right again the third term the third term is again the addition of the common difference to the second term second term here is the negative 2 right it is also negative 2 here right negative 2 plus the common difference that is 0 that is again negative 2 and the fourth term here is again the addition of the common difference to the third term right so that is why third term is here minus 2 and the 0 it means negative 2 again so we got the first term right that is negative 2 second term negative 2 third term again negative 2 right and the fourth term negative 2 and so on right so the first term second term and the third term all and the fourth term all are the same right so what we got from here that in an arithmetic progression the common difference can also be the zero common dif difference may be greater than zero uh, or less than zero or equals to zero right it, it, it may be anything common difference may be greater than zero common difference may be less than zero and common difference may be equals to zero I, it may be anything right so keep these things uh, this uh, shortcut or other concept in your mind okay now the third problem let me do 
if the third uh, in third uh, let me do with different color okay fine this one so third is in third problem first term is 4 and the common difference is negative 3 so I'm just writing the first term that is of course always and always the given first term that is 4 right and let me write now second term a2 is always the first term plus the a common difference right the first term plus the common difference so first term here is the 4 and the common difference here is the negative 3 so 4 minus 3 that is 1 right and again the third term is the addition of common difference right to the second term so second term plus common difference second term here is the 1 and the common difference here is the minus 3 I'm directly writing that plus minus minus so I'm just writing it is minus 2 right uh, and again fourth term is the addition of common difference to the third term so third term is minus 2 and addition of common difference that is negative 3 right so minus 2 minus 3 that is minus 5 so we got all the value first second third fourth so our AP is right 4 uh, and then 1 and then minus 2 and then minus 5 and so on right so this is our required AP uh, it, it, it is decreasing arithmetic progression right decreasing arithmetic series now let me do another one here common difference is negative one sorry common difference is half right common difference is half and the first term is negative 1 so here in third sorry in fourth right in fourth problem first term is minus 1 and the common difference is half okay now let's do this fine so the first term is always minus 1 as given and the second term we have as we have already learned the addition of common difference to the first term right so minus 1 plus half so it will be overall 2 and here if there is nothing then there is 1 right so 1 1 2 is a 2 so it is 2 times negative 1 plus again 2 1 is a 2 so 1 times 1 that is negative 2 plus 1 whole divided by 2 that is minus half right so the second term is minus half now the third term is again addition of common difference to the second term right and the second term r is half and the common difference is again half so what we got here right plus half minus half cut cut that is zero right now the fourth term again we know that the fourth term is the addition of common difference to the third term so the third term r is here zero and the common difference is half so it is half only right so what we got over here that the first term uh, is our right our series is let me write the series the, our series is our our uh, arithmetic progression is minus one right and again minus half and then zero and then half and so on so this is our arithmetic progression right require arithmetic progression and the, these are the first first four terms right and the last one I think it's last one right the first term is uh, my negative 1.25 and the common difference is negative 0 0.25 so let me do at last this one okay first term is here first term is here negative 1.25 and common difference is 0 0.25 but negative 1 right let me check whether it is not minus 125 yeah good so let's do this one okay so I think we know uh, you know now right you have learned properly so first term is of course that is minus 1.25 right and the second term is as usual the addition of common difference to the first term and here first term is minus 1.25 and here plus negative 0 0.25 negative 0 0.25 right okay so now minus 1.25 again minus 0 0.25 so it is now minus 1.5 right oh I 1.50 you can also write like this so again third term yeah of course the addition of second uh, the common difference to the second term and the second term is minus 1.50 plus minus 0 0.25 right so it is now minus 1.50 
minus plus minus minus right so 0 0.25 and it is minus negative right negative 1.75 right and the fourth term it is again third term plus the common difference so the third term is negative 1.75 and the fourth term is again sorry common difference is 0 0.25 right so I'm just going to add this minus 1.75 negative plus minus minus right so that's why 0 0.25 and now it is negative 2 right so what is our our, our arithmetic progression the first term is minus 1.25 right and the second term is minus 1.50 and third term is minus 1.75 and the fourth term is negative 2 right and so on this is our required for them so like this we have to find out the first four terms right in uh, any if, if you are given the first term and the common difference so this is the easiest one and if you go to the uh, website my website that is s k y i n z b l o g z e r right skying blogger.com uh, there i have listed a lots of problem related to this arithmetic progression uh, i i hope you'll be doing such problems and uh, make, uh, and that will really boost your problem uh, your skills in arithmetic progression okay we'll be meeting in the next video with the next problem next type of problem okay bye bye